House Republicans set a date of January 12th for their first attempt to repeal President Obama's health care law, a big vote that many Republicans promised on the campaign trail. The news comes as President Obama prepares to leave his Hawaii vacation spot later tonight and return here to Washington with a new and challenging political landscape. White House correspondent Mike Emanuel has that story from Honolulu. When the 112th Congress begins its work this week with Republicans taking control of the House, incoming Speaker John Boehner has pledged to repeal the health care law and replace it with common sense reforms. Congressman Fred Upton, the incoming chairman of the House Energy and Commerce Committee, previewed those plans. It's part of our pledge. We said that we would bring up uh, a vote to repeal health care early. That will happen before the President's State of the Union address. The day after the midterm election, President Obama was asked about the potential threat to the law with Republicans taking over the House. I think uh, we'd be misreading the election if uh, we thought that the American people want to see us for the next two years relitigate arguments that we had over the last two years. But the latest Rasmussen poll of likely voters reveals 60 percent favor repeal of the law, including 46 percent who strongly favor repeal. Upton says opposition in Congress won't be strictly partisan. We have 242 Republicans. There will be a significant number of Democrats, I think, that will join us. And Upton hopes a sizable vote against the law will put pressure on the Senate to do the same. One House Democrat who won't be joining is Congresswoman Debbie Wasserman Schultz, who argues this is a waste of time. For the Republicans to, right out of the gate in the 112th Congress, focus on a, a pointless harmful uh, attempt at repealing health care reform, which is never going to pass the Senate and is going to be vetoed by the president even if it did, uh, that, that, that's, it's totally irresponsible. With Mr. Obama in office and Democrats still the majority in the Senate, the odds of being able to repeal the law may be low. If that is the case, House Republicans will have plan B, picking the law apart. And we'll look at these individual pieces to see if we can't have the thing crumble. The whole process of this repeal effort in the House is expected to move very quickly with legislation posting with the Rules Committee as soon as tonight and then a committee meeting on Thursday. Then one week after this new Congress begins its work, uh, a vote to repeal in the House is expected. Brett? Mike Emanuel live in Honolulu this afternoon there. Sorry you have to come back, Mike.